Hello, in this video we are going to show you how to run a PHP server on a Mac via terminal. You don't need to install anything like XAMPP or MAMP or anything like that. You can easily run a PHP server via your terminal. So this is fantastic for just checking things out just really easily and really quickly. You probably wouldn't want to do this for a big project. You would want to install something like XAMPP or MAMP or some other Apache, MySQL and PHP package or you want to run it on a web server that you have access to online. First of all what you want to do is change directory to your project directory. So for me that is on the desktop right here. So I'm just going to drag like that. Let's get rid of this email. And now in here all we need to do is run our PHP server. To do that you type in PHP dash s 127.0.0.1 colon 8080. 8080 is just the port that we're going to be using for our local server. You could use another one, but I'm just going to be using 8080. Click enter, and that's it. To end the server, you would press Control C. I've ended it, so I can't run it now. So I'm just going to rerun it, and now it's running. At the moment, if I were to go to my browser to actually access the server, you do 127.0.0.1 colon 8080 80. that was weird I think it's two colons uh, ooh, what happened there 127.0 Doo -doo -doo -doo. oh I haven't got a file there oh, that's the issue so what I need to do inside here I need to create a file so I'm going to go just do some basic PHP echo hello world colon 8080 save that I save that to a website directory I'm going to save it as index.php I can close that down now go back refresh and as you can see it's successfully open you can also access your local server by putting localhost colon and then the port so for me it's 8080 and as you can see this has achieved the same result so it's that simple to run a PHP server locally via terminal without having to install anything and this will just give you some information about what's happening with your server in regards to files and other commands so we will have a link in the description to the commands in written form so you can check them out if you have any questions feel free to post them on our education platform sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash question.php there'll be a link in the description and as usual thank you for watching and i hope you have a great day